Hello lovelies, I am the Frognostic and tonight on Let's Slay we're knocking about with My Last Friday which I'm reliably informed is not Katy Perry themed, still waiting on that gem so no dancing on tabletops or doing too many shots and if we kissed, well I'd certainly remember it because I'm not a horrendously irresponsible human being I have a family, shame on you and shame on me for knowing the lyrics to that song. Good lord. Always the toilet, never a bed, always the bloody... Not even a clean toilet, ever. Oh god, no. No. No means no. Well. That's us good and raped, eh? Time for some revenge. What should we violate him with first? A cactus? His own teeth? There's the spiked Coca-Cola. Stupid, stupid! Whoa, hey, hey, this mirrors Trixie! But how would we have the key to our own cell? Something doesn't smell right. I'm not talking about my broken bottom. Oh. Punish them with pan! Oh, pain. Punish them with pain. Well, you could do either, really. What a god-awful film. Some sort of lock, I don't have the c, -c, -c combo to yet. Some captive doors. That's cruel, that. They don't do well in captivity. Oh dear. See, that's why I use a shower mat. Can I have your big knife arm? Fuck you, then. Locked! Bugger lumps. Unlocked! Huzzah! What have we here? An arm? Is that shower and stews? Just find his head and maybe he'll trade his limb blade for the set. Well, here's some sort of puzzly puzz puzz. Fraggers solve puzz puzz. Alright, I'm just gonna pop every one of these little bastards on and see where it gets me. It's always the simplest solutions, except this time. Ass cheeks. Okay. Then let us propose that the darker of the buttons be removed from the sequence, and with God on our side. Huzzah! The trial is passed. Who's the turd face now? <laughs> oh, we need a handle for that. <laughs> Oh, that would be the lock, one would imagine. Oh, <laughs> goodness me. Oh, uh, it is screwdriver or something for this. <laughs> Sorry. It's just, can you imagine? What the fuck did you call me? <laughs> oh, come on. Right. Three, <laughs> five. Seven, two. Oh, that's the stuff. <laughs> He's got his head in the toilet. And he's just chugging down bottles of x lax oh, I'll show you who's the motherfucking trad face! Oh. <laughs> oh. There's our handle. Ah, oh, we'll have a poke around town here before we go. <laughs> oh, that's out. Uh, I think it's all going to be fairly sequential here. Death is going to set them free. It will set us all free one day. Some are uh, less shit cake than others. What's in your drawers, boss? Nothing and... Uh, oh, it's a big poo! Oh, God! Oh, my! Oh, no, it's, it's only guts. Panic over. It's a common intestine. <laughs> Merely a link from the stomach to the anus. I mean, who wouldn't want to spare one of them? Alright, let's pop this generator up. And there it is! To the lift. There's blood everywhere. I mean, it's everywhere, look. Unbelievable. There's scary serial killer ambience, and then there's living in a shit tip, isn't there? 
There we are. So that'll fix the door upstairs. May I use the lift? No, it needs a key. Which I dare say is back upstairs. Right, so. I always wanted to see somewhere like this on Extreme Makeover Home Edition. Denise Ramsey from Kansas has been living in the old lair of serial killer the Dickinson County Ripper for two years now. Yeah, I don't know where he went, probably dead or something. Anyway, I got bone disease, can I have a jacuzzi now? Denise claims constant harassment from local law enforcement, who note her striking resemblance to a photo fit of the Ripper, disguised in an unconvincing wig and inexplicable beard. I don't know what they're talking about, I just want a walk-in wardrobe. No, oh, no. What's this? Some sort of maths quiz. Some sort of educational test. Ha! <laughs> this game has no idea who it's fucking with. I'll have you know I scraped a D in business studies. Hmm. Well, there's no equals sign. So it's not sums. I don't even know what it is. And there's no way I can see to back out of this. At all. Oh, bloody hell. We're just gonna have to brute it open, aren't we? Right. Good lord. There we are! Good old process of elimination. That's the Sherlock way. Yeah, look, there it is. A minus with an extra stroke and exits on the end. Who is on the middle seat? I don't remember that. Oh, that, that tells you the bloody answer, doesn't it? Straight away. Give me my key. I'm leaving. Check the drawers. Bloody hell, how many spare intestines do you need, mates? That's called stockpiling, and it's frowned upon. What's that? <laughs> Showering stew! It's a miracle! Stop stabbing me, you dick! What gives you that right? You don't even have a head. You're a joke. Fuck. Stab me all you want, what do you think is going to happen after that? You're going to leave, get a job, nobody will employ you, or shoot on sight. Get the fuck out, occupied, go away! I uh, can't even pick up his head to give it back to him. Wash the shite out of his nostrils first. Is he gone? Mate, I found your heads. You might need to run it under the tap. Well, balls to you then. Get out, you pervert. Right, if I let you in, you're gonna take your head and leave, yes? You, you dishonourable decapity. You snake in the grass. Can't even move now, God damn it! I'm resigned to a terrible fate. Murdered by a headless man in a toilet. Don't tell my kids. Tell them I died pulling kittens out of a fire. Come on, give me something if I can't use the screwdriver on him. This is... Hello! Ah, oh, it's on now, Stu. Stabomania 13 is go. Yes, it's a real knife. Dance, motherfucker! Aha! You're in the jungle now, boy. You're gonna die! And there he goes. Baffled, defeated, and dead. Did you know venomous snakes can continue to bite and attack you for hours after they die? Even if they've been decapitated. They've got pits on the side of their faces that detect threats. And they carry on functioning after death. Sweet dreams. Ooh, ooh, what's your game, pal? Hey, Jeffrey. Hope you haven't forgotten that it's Friday. You know, the day of the senior prom. Uh, I'm not Jeffrey. My name's Howard. Oh, sorry. I thought you were my best friend, Jeffrey. You know, the lights here are just... Uh, let's get some answers. Are you the one who locked me inside the bathroom? What? No, it was me. Oh, uh, okay. And what about you? Are you going to the prom? You want to kiss my ass? You want to suck my dick? You want me to be your date or what? Ha ha ha, you're funny. No, definitely not. Me and Jeff have no dates for the prom. We only go there to get drunk and laugh on the idiots who think this is going to be grace night of their life. 
So you want to join us? Uh. Wow, you guys are hardcore. Okay, maybe I'll show up. Great. Do you know the boys' restroom in the school on the second floor? Be there at 1930. I bring a bottle of whiskey so we can boost that party. Alright. <laughs> cool. And don't forget, 1930. Don't forget, 1930. And don't you forget to stitch your spine back in! God damn it. Right. To realms unknown! What's, uh. What's crack here like? Oh, I see the flush in numbers. So. 1930, yes? Yes! Oh, I'm so done with my prom dates trying to murder me, let me tell you. There you go. Quite enjoyed that. And I hope you did too. Because your happiness is really important to me. Bye, friends. Yeah.